we're having a little segment about pants, but I had to show you guys. Look, it's a monkey. It's a monkey hat. I got the dollar store, a buck fifty. But sometimes if you put it back here, it's like a monkey yamuka. They put the little Jewish hat that guys put on their heads. Uh, obviously, I'm not a man, but look, it's a monkey. <laughs> now that I'm back and I'm looking a little bit more normal and not like I'm trying to make a fool of myself, um, we are going to discuss pants. I have. I have some pants on the line, not really on the line, but like beside me here, and I'll hold them up and I will discuss them. I don't know what I'll say, I don't know what to do, but they'll be discussed. <laughs> yes, that was my ass, and if you have a problem with that, well that sucks. Now, as I have just shown you, I am wearing sweatpants. Hold up. I am wearing sweatpants. These are my favorite pair of pants, and yes, they do say pasty on the butt. Why? Look at my skin. Now you know. So anyways, um, this, as I said before, this is a suggestion from a friend of mine on something to do, but it's not just pants specifically. There is, there's some more detail to this, uh, discussion, this, I'm out of smart words, actually. Um, so, the point of this is how irritating it is to put on pants. Like, you have this one pair of pants or whatever, and like, there's always that certain point, like mid-thigh, where it's just harder to pull on it. So, and the moment you get it out there, and you're like, suck it, and then you got to do the butt and everything, because it makes your butt look nice. I don't know if guys have that issue, but if you guys are focusing on your butt, um, personally, I don't really care if guys are booty-licious. Booty-licious. So, yeah, that's pretty much one of the things I want to say. So I have some pants here. Now, these, this is what I usually wear to bed. They're boxers. Little, mis little, little piece of trivia and advice. A lot of girls do wear boxers to bed, surprisingly. They are comfortable, they are breezy, and they do all sorts of fantastical things. Like, if you're a guy, you can let it, like, dangle and chill around, then you got a little, a little button here. So, like, if you wake up in the middle of the night, you don't have to pull your pants, and then you pee. And then, or jack off, or I'm not sure, whatever, whatever suits your lifestyle. And then next we have, this is the closest pair of pants I could find, here are some pants, they're blue, I don't wear them often, but these, these are what I usually wear, and I don't know if you'd see this, but see how short like the zipper is, yeah, that's such a pain in the bitch to do up, but I'm so glad that guys who wear the pants down low, I found things like these. This is a belt, guys. And it helps keep your pants up, not down around your knees. So I'd appreciate it if some of you guys would pull your pants up, but not to your armpits, because then that is so gross. Like, you have no idea. And I'd like to show my belts. Look at that. Zombies! Yeah, this is a present from a friend of mine. Disturbed! Shining it in the camera. Anyways, so that's an old discussion about pants. Like, sometimes it'd be so much easier if you didn't have to wear pants. Like, I'm t like, we can keep our underwear on, like, guys can be creative with this as I am doing right now, but don't wear, go ahead, don't wear pants, like, when I'm home alone, I just walk around naked, do it, it's the best feeling, there's, like, adrenaline at first, because you don't know if anyone's going to come home, and they're going to see you naked in the kitchen making a peanut butter sandwich, but then after a while you get used to it, it's like, oh, I'm naked, because it's, you know, natural, you know, we don't have to be wearing clothes, in fact, just kidding, for all you pervs out there, I don't do that. So, I guess the moral thing on the day is, is that we all have that one pair of pants that we just don't want to throw out. And we always want to keep, and, we, and it, it's just it's just a war to put them on. And you know what? Lose some weight. No, I'm just kidding. If, if, it's, if it can still fit around your waist, cut them up into shorts. And, I don't know, just find a way to use them, or make them hand-me-downs, because I'm sure if you got some good use out of them, and they still make, and they make your butt, they used to make your butt look good, I'm sure they'll make someone else's butt, someone else's butt look good, too. So, donate to charities, or if you have nice clothes, because, you know, I could always use a little mix of swagger. So, there's my little thing of pants, and I told you my BBC thing already with my gangster swag on. So, I realize this video is going to be kind of long. Hopefully, it was funny enough that you guys paid attention. So, thank you guys for watching again, and, um, ciao! Bleh.